Well, another poll that reinforces a couple of patterns that we have seen since Rishi Sunak became Prime Minister. First of all, that there is virtually no bounce for the new PM. We saw at scrutiny, of course, applied to Liz Truss that doesn't seem now to be being applied to Rishi Sunak, who so far hasn't really improved the Conservatives' performances in polls at all. You see here in the latest YouGov poll, Labour's on 47% there, the Conservatives on 26%. Labour's still at around double the support of the Tories. There has been very little sign, very little sign indeed, of any bounce. The second trend that we have seen in recent polls is a rise in support for Reform UK, which I know many of you are now switching to Reform or considering doing so. And in this latest YouGov poll again here, you see Reform up one on six compared to the Lib Dems on nine and the Greens on five. And I just think when you consider the fact Reform UK have relatively little media coverage, no representation in Parliament, if they can in time overtake the Lib Dems to become the third party, and we did see that in one poll already, then that would send a real statement, I think, ahead of the election where Richard Tice, of course, is planning to stand at candidates in every constituency pretty much. But just look at this. In terms of the Starmer versus Sunak head-to-head -head now, Starmer's lead has fallen, but he still has a lead over Sunak. And in terms of support for reform, when you dig into the data, 13% of those who vote Conservative at the last election now switching to reform. 14% of Brexiteers currently intend to vote for reform. Just 48%, so fewer now than half of Leave voters are back in the Tories. And you see there, a rise in support from Leavers for Labour. 25% of Brexiteers currently backing Labour. And I have to say, but you did, of course, see Keir Starmer addressing the issue of immigration and basically outflanking the Tories. So, yeah, as I said, this shows a number of patterns, a number of trends continuing, a reform rising, and no poll balance for the Tories who are still way behind Labour. Let me know if any of that surprises you in the comments below, guys. I'll keep bringing you the very latest, so please do whack this video a quick thumbs up. And, of course, as ever, cheers for watching.